What are equivalent fractions? In simple terms, fractions that are similar or equal are known as equivalent fractions. Equivalent fractions, when represented pictorially, would also look similar. If you place the image of one equivalent fraction over another, it would look similar. How can you say that two fractions are equivalent? Examples explain math better than description. So let's see an example. 1 by 2 is equivalent to 2 by 4. How can you get 2 from 1? Multiply 1 by 2. How can you get 4 from 2? Multiply 2 by 2. So, we multiplied both the numerator and denominator of one fraction by 2 to get the other fraction. Another example. In this example, we divide the numerator and denominator of one fraction by three to get the other fraction. Two fractions are called equivalent fractions when we multiply or divide the numerator and denominator of one fraction by the same number and get the other fraction. Remember that you can only multiply or divide to find an equivalent fraction and don't use any other operations such as addition or subtraction. In equivalent fractions, you have to do the same operation, division or multiplication, on both the numerator and denominator. You can't do multiplication on numerator and division on the denominator. How to find out if two fractions are equivalent fractions? Let's take the fractions 2 by 4 and 4 by 8 and find out whether they are equivalent or not. We have to multiply the numerator of one fraction with the denominator of the other fraction. This is also known as cross multiplication. After multiplying, we have to compare the two products. If both the products are equal, then both the fractions are equivalent fractions. In this example, 2 multiplied by 8 is equal to 16. 4 multiplied by 4 is equal to 16. Since both the products are equal, 2 by 4 and 4 by 8 are equivalent fractions. In math, there are always different ways to arrive at an answer. Let's analyze 2 by 4 and 4 by 8 in another way. When we multiply the numerator and denominator of 2 by 4 by 2, we get 4 by 8. So, 2 by 4 and 4 by 8 are equivalent fractions. Find the equivalent fraction of a given fraction. To find the equivalent fraction of any given fraction, you just have to multiply or divide the numerator and the denominator of the given fraction by any whole number other than 1. Why can't you use 1? What difference is it going to make? Multiplying or dividing a number by 1 is going to give the same number. Find the equivalent fraction of 2 by 4. When we multiply both the numerator and denominator of 2 by 4 by 2, we get 4 by 8. 4 by 8 is an equivalent fraction of 2 by 4. When we divide both the numerator and denominator of 2 by 4 by 2, we get 1 by 2. 1 by 2 
is an equivalent fraction of 2 by 4. Find the equivalent fraction of a given fraction with numerator of final fraction mentioned. Find the equivalent fraction of 5 by 7 with the numerator 45. To find the answer, let's write the question in a mathematical form. Simplifying the question is very important in mathematics. Coming back to the question, how many times 5 gives 45? The answer is 9. So, multiply the denominator also by 9 to get the answer. Another example. Find the equivalent fraction of 81 by 36 with the numerator 9. First, you have to write the question in a mathematical form. Now, divide 81 by 9. It is equal to 9. So, you have to perform division on the denominator also. We divide 36 also by 9 and get 4. So, 9 by 4 is the equivalent fraction of 81 by 36.